love is damaged Would you love me the same? Would you vanish? Or would you not be ashamed to see me manic? Would you bring me back down? No, oh, when I panic Can you be my zany? Without the liquor We don't know how to behave Touch of a finger And you can make me insane But when I'm sober Would you love me that way? Hi guys and welcome back to my youtube channel to my returning subscribers thank you so much guys welcome back to the new year welcome back to the new year well happy new year <laughs> happy new year um, i'm glad that you've made it alive i'm glad that you've made it healthy you've made it happy and i'm glad that you're here to stay for another year and the year after that and the year after that and the year after that and the year after that, and the year after that. if you are new to this channel Remember to click on the subscribe button. It should be somewhere here or somewhere here. I'm not quite sure. But click the subscribe button, guys. It's nice here. We are nice people. Join the family. <laughs> but anyway, guys, this is just a quick video to say Happy New Year. To wish you all the best for this new year. I wish all your dreams and all your wishes are going to come come true. Come through. Come through and come true. I hope that all your, your wishes come true. I hope that you accomplish everything that you want to accomplish this year. I hope that this is the year where you get off your feet and you go after what you need. That you um I hope that you discover yourself, you discover your purpose, and you go after your passion and your dreams. And man, I just hope this year, like I hope I wish. I want that for you guys. I want that for you guys. I want it to be a great year. Um, I just thought we should talk about how 2020 was and um, yeah, the things that I got up to in 2020. The reason why I wanted to do this video is because I'm busy planning for, um, how does this even face? I don't know. Basically, I'm planning, I'm busy planning for 2021 and on this side, I'm doing my planning for my youtube videos and i just thought let me just do a quick happy new year welcome to the new year welcome to the channel to new subscribers da -da -da, da -da 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 -da. just like i'm just so happy that we are here i'm i'm so happy um especially with the whole COVID mess that's going on it has now become way stronger than it was before um it's so funny how the other day me and my friend were just, just talking about how the numbers have now turned into names of the people that we know like I, I, there's people that are close to me there's people that are close to people that are close to me who have been infected by the virus most of them have um what's the word most of them have healed from it and they've been cured or it had yeah they've healed from it but some of the people that i do know have actually had their loved ones pass away from this horrible horrible virus so guys i sure hope that you're taking care of yourself i hope that you are wearing your masks you're sanitizing and most importantly i hope that you are staying indoors guys if you don't need to go outside for anything that's important don't do it it's not worth it you're gonna put the people that you live with in on risk at risk and you're gonna put yourself at risk also which is totally not worth it so yeah Anyway, so I wanted to talk about what I got up to in 2020. I think the first thing that I got up to is quite obvious, which is my YouTube channel. Um, I started YouTube in 2019, but then I did like two videos <laughs> and I used Snapchat for those videos and I was like, mm. and then 2020 when we went into the first lockdown, I tried again and then I stopped and then I went back again um, towards the end of the year and I haven't stopped ever since. That's like three months ago. I don't know. Thank you so much guys to my new subscribers. I saw that I gained a couple of new subscribers while I was gone. You guys are stars. And another thing that, sorry I keep on looking down because I wrote everything down child. I don't want to miss anything. <laughs> another thing that I wanted to talk about is all the accomplishments that I accomplished in 2020. The reason why I want to talk about this is because most of them I wouldn't have accomplished if it wasn't for the lockdown. As funny as it is. Or as weird as it may sound like I, I i feel like i've accomplished that because of the lockdown i got my post grade i passed i'm ready i'm getting ready to graduate it's good <laughs> we're happy we are double qualified <laughs> we're graduating again so i feel like I, w I wouldn't have been able to do that if it wasn't for the hard lockdown because i started working from home that meant more time for myself as much as i had more time for work 
I'm so sorry about that. I had to um, close the windows because I'm shooting next to the window. That's why this lighting is so great. Um, shooting next to the window and I wanted to sh close it because now the rain has stopped. It's been raining and the kids are out playing in muddy puddles and just making noise. But nonetheless, so where was I? Yeah. So those are time like I, I don't think I would have been able to complete my studies in record time also if we hadn't gone into lockdown basically because i feel like there was less stress on me like there was less there was less um the pressures of going into the office every day was not there which brings me to purpose if i could put it like that like i remember i read somewhere once that if you want to see if you were meant to do something you can tell by how you feel when you're doing it when you're not meant to do something it will not feel right even in the greatest moments it will still not feel right like it will be a temporary temporary um happiness if i may say so so one thing about lockdown and one thing about tenny tenny is it made me realize that i was not serving my purpose in life when it comes to my career it made me realize that I'm not happy, you know, um, I'm happy with, oof. I'm happy with the people I work with. I'm happy with the environment in which I work in. I'm happy with the location. Like I'm happy with everything else, but not, not the job, not the work. I don't know if you get it. It's getting hot. I think that's getting hard because I'm getting more passionate but anyway let's move um so yeah and another thing that I've accomplished is just like getting to know myself better um self growth uh personal growth if I might if I may put it like that I have I feel like I've spent a lot of I've never spent that much time alone and the first lockdown I was literally alone because my son was with my mom so I was, it was just me and everyone was indoors in I tell you in that period I have learned so much about myself that I didn't even know like I've discovered the things that would trigger me I've discovered the things that make me happy I've discovered my purpose like I've just gotten to know myself much better which made it easier for me to now set my goals because I know what I want and I know what purpose I have in life I may not understand I may not fully understand the purpose and I may not be able to pinpoint it and say this is what I'm meant to do but I know which road which road to take or I know which road not to take so 2020 um what do I have planned for 2020 when it comes to my youtube channel I cannot wait I cannot wait <laughs> to take it to greater heights um I can't wait to start I can't wait till I create more content. I feel like I'm slowly trying to find myself around the YouTube streets. I'm trying to find myself. Um, I guess you guys will be able to tell what the kind of videos that I'll be uploading. Uh, but I'm going to start with like... Um, well, I'm not going to start with, but throughout the year, I'll be updating my equipment. At first, I, th I thought I needed a new camera, a DSLR. But I realized all I need is a new lens because what good is a great camera without a great lens right so i'm working to working towards getting a new lens i need to get a new lighting and i need to get new software i'm happy with the software that i'm using now but i want to learn and uh, explore other softwares that i can use to better my videos so that's also in the book or also in the books for 2021 um, another thing is I need I want to create a shooting studio I will be showing you guys that very soon um, I will shoot a video on that um, I'm gonna turn one of the rooms in this house that I live in into a shooting studio so I'm so excited so excited about that um, nothing fancy just a couple of like background aesthetic aesthetically good aesthetic backgrounds <laughs> that I'm gonna set up in the corner or in every almost in every wall of that room so I will have like different backgrounds to shoot in but anyway I'm not gonna talk about that a lot because it will be in my next video 
be on the lookout for that um and another thing is sorry i need to look at my list <laughs> i'm gonna be studying again i know i told a lot of people like no i'm done not again maybe in two three years but then i realized like i set the two three years mark for doing my masters but who's who, like no one said i can't do anything else while waiting to do my masters right so i have set a goal to do three certificates in the year 2021 so yeah starting with a digital marketing one that i always wanted to do so i'm gonna start that i've already enrolled and we're starting in march i've enrolled with um vega school of branding so that's what i'm gonna do vega brand school vega school vega <laughs> <laughs> so that's what I'm gonna do and then we'll see as time goes what other certificate I'm gonna do but I am planning on doing my masters I just don't know in which year because it's so expensive um, I'm, I'm not sure probably in 2022 or 2023 that's another topic for another day and then also another thing that I wanted to do is new career moves this is in connection to what I said when I said in 2020, like I realized that, you know what? My calling is not what I'm doing. <laughs> I have another calling and it's about time that I nurtured that dream, that I nurtured that passion uh, because it was given to me for a reason and I need to explore that. So in 2021, I'm hoping to make new career moves. Um, I won't say much because I don't want to give away a lot, but it's going to be a great year. <laughs> It's gonna be a great year Last but definitely not least is self-care. I want to take care of myself more this year I want to continue taking care of myself and even going beyond what I was doing in the previous years. This means physically emotionally mentally um, Spiritually um, Financially like every part of Every part that makes me me or every part of my being I need to start taking care of so that's what I'm gonna do uh, speaking of which I don't know if you guys can tell that I'm growing my hair because it's much longer than well it's short hair and you probably can't tell and I apologize for the white dress and the white hair and the white wall the white belly guys I had already dressed up because I'm going somewhere for um, dinner so I just thought I should do quickly do this video before I leave but so I can't change can't you guys have to keep up with you have to like i'm sorry like i probably look like a highlighter on a reflector <laughs> because of the colors but i'm sorry guys so i'm growing my hair because i want number one because i really want to grow my hair i miss my hair i'm gonna insert a picture of how my hair was before i cut it i feel like i cut it for a reason because i like i'm a rib little bit I'm a liberal woman I can do anything that I want I'm free to do anything that I want and last year I just felt like cutting my hair and coloring it and I enjoyed this hairstyle so much but now I miss my hair so I'm going to grow back my hair and I always keep my hair natural so I'll take you guys with me throughout this journey I don't know if I'm gonna do a weekly video but I feel like now it's too early to start doing the video. So I'm going to wait for it to grow a bit. So we're definitely doing that. We're going to do a hair growth series. And another thing is I'm, I want to I wanna be healthy. Healthy how? Like I want to, number one, I have allergies. <laughs> which I clearly do not take seriously because I'm taking allergy pills. I want to get to a place where I don't need my allergy pills. Get to a place where I don't reject... What? I want to get to a place... I want to get to a place where I don't react to my allergies. Um, and the only way I will not react is if I stop taking gluten So by being healthy, that's what I mean. I want to go completely gluten free <laughs> I don't know how I'll do that um, It's very hard because there's a lot of things that have gluten in it. It's ridiculous from like spices to drinks to like there's just too much so obviously I will still be getting like a little bit of gluten from here and there but I don't want to take obvious gluten this means letting go of bread 
letting go of bread or anything made from flour but yeah i believe i can do it so that's that's what i mean by being more healthy um eating healthy would, would be a huge part of it um i don't know if i want to lose a lot of weight but i do want to lose enough so that the clothes in my closet fit me because i have so many clothes that i bought in the previous years and i still love them including this dress that i'm wearing it's just that a dress with dresses i don't I don't necessarily have problems especially this one because it's very stretchy so but i have a lot of clothes that don't fit anymore and i would i would love for them to fit again i've gone two sizes up from all my clothes that i bought from like 2019 downwards and i hate it i don't want to lie i hate it i love my body i love my shape i love how i look i hate the fact that i've gained from how i was in 2019 backwards i want to go back there so that's what i'm hoping for and i'll probably do a healthy eating or going back to health road to health i don't know what i'm gonna call it series that will focus mainly on that so yeah that's what we're doing this year and yeah i hope you guys will enjoy the videos that i'll be posting throughout the whole year because i i do this for y'all <laughs> okay no i do this for your entertainment for you guys to enjoy so i hope you guys will enjoy all the videos that i'll be posting in 2021 i pray and i hope that all everything that we wish for in the new year is gonna come true i think that's it for this video again happy new year thank you so much for subscribing and i hope you guys guys please comment down below and let me know if you have any new year resolutions or any goals i don't want to call them new year resolutions because those ones never work but do you have any new goals that you want to reach in this year um yeah i comment down below and let me know i'll be doing my vision board very soon and i'll show i'll be sure to take you guys through with me and i just hope like you guys are going to enjoy the content that i'll be putting out in 2021 i'm going to work so hard on it you guys will probably see so thank you thank you thank you guys and remember to all the people that are here for the first time please click the subscribe button please click the subscribe button and i'll see you guys on the next video bye